Scorpio, Scorpio, Scorpio. Y'all's message is about to be messy as hell. I'm giving you the warning to begin with because the songs that came up, <laughs> trigger warning. <laughs> anyway, so Easy Terra Terra back at it again. <sighs> This is a general, oh, I say a general, this is, this is, this is not going to be a message for everybody, but, okay, so, <sighs> y'all, y'all, song, I done, sw I switched devices and turned on, look, look, it's on the bottom of the deck, messy, I'm telling you, don't, don't come for me, anyway, so I switched devices to listen to Pandora to see what would randomly pop up, what was Spirit's message through um, music for the Scorpio, and <laughs> I still got the same song. Okay, I switched channels and still got the same song. So, Pop Star by Drake is going to it, it somehow that resonates with y'all for the month of August. Okay, and it's I'm telling you, y'all better watch y'all's vehicles. Somebody's being messy. You've got like somebody like is plotting on you. Um. The main thing that stuck out is I'm a I'm a pop star, not a doctor. Cops pulling up like I'm selling drugs. Like I just feel like you really need to be aware. Pay attention to your surroundings in August. Somebody's trying to set you up. Okay? Like I almost feel like there's possibly a warrant out for someone's arrest. This may not be you. This may be somebody in your energy or somebody who you... Or this could be... Look, this is either for the Scorpio or somebody you're dealing with, okay? So, just be vigilant in the month of August when you're out. Mm-hmm. Confirmation right there. Some computer went off. So, um... Anyway, so the next song that came on... I was like, come on, you, I got I got to get another one for them, them Scorpios because, like, this is getting redundant here. Um, Queen of Broken Hearts came out, right? And you may, I, and I, I, can't, I shit you not, I watched something on YouTube earlier today where this queen was sitting there talking about girls who date, um, this girl who was dating a, a queen, like a man who was basically pretending to be like, basically someone who is in denial, pretend, like not wanting to be gay, but then they're really gay and using you as a cover up. That is going to be significant for somebody because like queen of broken hearts, you're dating a queen or you're dealing with a queen. It's someone who is not they're not happy with who they are. They, like, or if this might be somebody that you've, you had, like, dated in the past or had some kind of relationship that it just didn't work out and that's why it didn't work out. This person is in denial about their sexuality. And I believe this person actually has a drug issue. Um, they either drink too much or they party too much. They do something in excess in order to, ooh, that, this is the message. They're doing something in excess um, in order to um, not think about the fact that they're, you know, they're not comfortable with, ooh, I looked up, saw 33. They're not comfortable with the fact that they're gay or bisexual. Like, they're having to come to terms with that themselves. And in the month of August, I feel like they're overdoing something. They're over, like, that issue, whatever they're doing in order to cope with their, you know, them not being true to who they are. Um, it's really affecting this person in the month of August, okay? Like, when did I become so dark? This person is, like, losing who they are. But, like, the main message is, whoever you are, like, this person, like, somebody is dealing with a bisexual person who is a freaking queen, baby. Like, this is a queen. Um, and, you know... No, no, I don't throw shade on, you know, anybody's sexuality, but it's like when you're sitting here, um, I feel like they're, they were using you or they were, you were using them or they were using you. It was all a cover up. Um, but anyways, they're, they're trying to figure out how to, they're, 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 they're coping with their situation in August and I feel like. In the way that they're coping with the situation, they're probably going to end up getting locked up. Actually, they are going to end up getting locked up. Like, 
I'm seeing somebody getting pulled over. Oh, God. Either there's an accident involving, like, this person. There's an accident involving this person, and they're found unresponsive. Like, they're, they were doing way too much, and... They overdid it. This person overdid it. And they were using this drug as an escape to their everyday life. Like, they, they, they're, they're coping with the fact that they're not happy with who they are. Like, this is somebody who clearly hasn't done the work and hasn't found themselves. But, um, this is, I feel like this is, look, somebody is, this is somebody who was shooting up as well. Either, like, either shooting up, whatever it was, it was, like, some serious drugs, okay? And, like, they're, it's finally catching up with this person. Like, stagnation. Like, I'm seeing, like, no movement. Like, I'm seeing no movement. But, like, the chariot, like, I'm seeing police all cars. And that goes along with, um, this goes along with that, uh, pop star, cops pulling up. I don't know. Anyways, I'm going to get out of that because that was very intense. I'm out. Um, anyways, let's go ahead and get into this message <laughs> because that was messy. Somebody is a queen, baby. A queen. And, like, I feel like and that person who was hiding themselves and who they are, they're being outed in the month of August. And I believe they're becoming actually very emotional about being outed. Like, it's going to be very public. Okay. What does the Scorpio need to know for the month of August? Let's see what we get. <laughs> you may possibly have children with this person. Or may be dealing with a legal situation in regards to this person. And, like, over money. Like, I feel like this person is... You're dealing with an emperor individual in the month of August who is all about their money and counting stack and paper wanting to have the best of the best okay so in the month of august it seems as if someone who is um there's going to be some serious conversations had about where you see your life in the next 10 years or, you know, partnerships and agreements and stability. Like, there's, like, a heart, like, this is um, a main focus for you in August. Um, but I also see wishes being granted. It's, like, something that you've wanted for a long time. The emotional fulfillment, like, if the partnership hasn't been solidified, it's being solidified in August. What's not seen about the situation is you're needing to heal family issues. Like, I believe there may have been a third-party situation going on for some of you that is being worked through and being healed in the month of August. And it's like you're being asked to keep an open mind about the situation. Um, I believe some of you, like, if there was a third-party situation going on for some of you, like... The person that you are dealing with, like, the other person, whoever it was that was sitting there holding on to something mentally, they haven't been able to let it go. Triumph of lies popped out, okay? Like, I believe somebody tried to act like they were over some things and they weren't actually over some things. And it's, like, resurfacing in a way that it has to be put to rest. Um, and it's almost like, it's, obsess it's obsessive energy. It's not being able to let something go. Why is it getting so loud? Hold on a second. Sorry about that. Get back into my zone. Okay. There's some kind of obsessive behavior going on in the in the household that's having to be addressed. So what's the obsessive obsession? <laughs> Ugh, hiding your true self. 
Okay, so for some of you, you are actually with someone who is, um, is, is possibly bisexual. Actually, I really, I really feel bisexual. Um, and they've been hiding it. They've been keeping it from you. Like, masquerade. Like, they've been hiding it from everybody. This is a queen. Somebody's dealing with a freaking queen. And it's been under wraps this whole time. It's like they've been lying to their, themselves. They've been lying to themselves. They've been lying to others. And I must, like, this is somebody. Okay, this is somebody who, they bash people who are um, gay Actually, I get. I don't even get that. They don't bash gay women. Whoever this is, they bash gay men. And they're a gay man themselves. What in the hell? Like, obsessively bash people. Like, whoever this is, like, they obsessively bash gay men. Like, obsessively. And underneath it all, they're a freaking gay man. Like... And I'm getting some of you have like had a child with this person. But they're bisexual. This person is definitely bisexual. They like men and women. Um and I, I don't I really don't feel like you are aware of this. I really don't feel like you were aware of this. Like, they've been hiding the mask in the, the mask. Oh, Lord. Let's see. Is this, is this really coming out in August? What the hell is this? I'm coming in. I want the world to know. Look, they're not, they don't want the world to know, but I feel like somebody's coming out in the month of August. Oh, goodness. And what I'm getting is they're being forced out. I, like, I, what I'm getting is they didn't want to come out. Like, I feel like they would have took this shit to the grave if they would have had the opportunity to take it to the grave, okay? And I feel like it's going to be emotional for them the way that they're coming. Like, the way that it's being thrown out to everybody. Like, this is a very stubborn person. Like, they were going to take this to the grave. Look, comment below at the end of the month and let me know who this was for because this is a mess. <laughs> this is a mess. Oh, goodness. All right, what's going on for finances and career for the Scorpio? Something coming fast. The moon. Sneaky behavior. All right. What's going on in the place of finances and career? Today for tomorrow, underneath envious gluttony. Mm. I almost feel like there's some kind of there's some kind of competition going on in the place of employment. And somebody's being really sneaky trying to outdo you. Somebody who like I feel like you may hold the same position as this person. Um they may be a cancer or they may be another Scorpio. Um but I, what I'm really getting is this person is like the type of person who wants to win at all costs. And they're used to having everything their way. And that, look, I'm, am I, I going to take these? Disconnecting boredom, destiny, victory, and success. But you're meant to come out on top of everything. Like, you're separating yourself from, I guess, the feeling of... I feel like you're separating yourself from feeling like you're actually competing with somebody and you're like just doing your the best that you can do, period. You're like, the best I can do is the best I can do and that is all that I will do, okay? Like, and I feel like in doing that and you going above, like staying on, like on higher ground, like I'll get this person is freaking sneaky. Whoever, whoever this is that's trying to throw you under the bus, I feel like they're talking crap about you in the place of employment. Um, and I do get that you're actually going to be hearing about this in the month of August. This person who was, you know, being sneaky, um, and talking crap or trying to 
make you look bad in the place of employment, I feel like it's it's definitely going to be out of, like, I, I believe, like, you're going to see this, like, you're going to see the sneaky behavior, and you're going to hear some things about, like, somebody's going to come and tell you what's been going on behind your back in regards to this person. But I do get that you're going to be the one to, you know, excel and move forward because you're staying on the higher frequency. Because what's meant for you is meant for you and no one can take it from you is really what I'm getting. Um, okay. But something's coming fast in regards to your finances and career. Let's see, I've got way too much over here. Something's coming fast. Let's see, what's coming fast in your place of employment and career? What's coming fast for the Scorpio? Finances and career. What's coming fast for them? What's coming fast for the Scorpio? A raise. A raise. I feel like you're going to definitely be getting some kind of proposition come in for you in the place of employment and in regards to um, somebody's going to offer you a different position, a different title. Um, something's definitely going to be changing in your work, the way that you're working in August. What's not seen is I believe you're going to be getting some kind of proposition from a Pisces or another water fellow water sign, but I'm really seeing Pisces. Um... In the month of August, somebody's but the person was look Achilles heel. Somebody was trying to come for your weak spot. Someone was trying to get you to act out of character in the month of August. But I still see you getting the raise or getting the recognition that you were wanting to achieve, mainly because you stayed so level-headed. You didn't react to this person who was trying to shake you up. You just, you know, kept doing what you were doing. And in that, you're coming to, like, a really, like, a really positive time. The sun card. Like, that's that's one of the most positive cards in the deck. But if this was in regards to a legal situation, you're also winning, like, I see winning a legal situation. Like, some kind of peaceful proposition is going to come in in regards to someone who's, who's, not trying to fight with you anymore. Like, I feel like that, like, they, they see that you would be the one to, like, you are, you have the upper hand in the situation. And somebody's no longer wanting to fight with you because they know they can't win. Is really what I'm getting for that. Somebody's kind of, like, giving, giving up the fight. You're being, you're being, um, recognized in the month of August for, you know, Look, being the better option is kind of what I'm hearing. Being the better option, being the bigger person, being the bigger person, being the better option. Um, that is going to um, be what helps you excel in your place of employment, career, or financial situations, okay? What else? Okay, there's something hidden that's what's not seen. Is it something that's causing you anxiety? Unseen anxiety. What is that? Something's causing you unseen anxiety in the month of August. What is that? That's too many. Let me put them back in. Messages clearly. It's messages. Messages that you're receiving causing you sleepless nights. Anxiety. A betrayal, a feeling of betrayal in regards to a knight of pentacles. Options that need to be, that you need to be taken in regards to, somebody's dealing with some kind of legal situations, okay? Okay, oh my goodness. Somebody was doing some shady shit leak. Like, I don't know if I, I feel like somebody has got. Okay. Nine, nine. Something's closing out. 
there's going to be a tower moment that takes place in regards to a third party situation. I got nine, nine, nine. Oh my God. Okay. So, <sighs> there's going to be some kind of shakeup in regards to finances, definitely in the month of um, finances and career. In all these pictures, he's looking down. Okay, and this is a nine too. What's well, not saying is you need to pay attention to the fine print in the month of August. There's something about some kind of communications that you need to be focusing on in the month of August. I feel like there's some shady shit going on in the legal situations. Like, something hasn't been uncovered quite yet in regards to a legal situation, but I feel like it's on its way out. Like, it's on its way to being outed. Somebody was hiding, hiding some kind of, somebody was hiding some kind of betrayal in regards to money finances somebody's hiding money somebody is hiding money i'm really getting that you were going to find out that somebody was like laundering money hiding money from you somebody was doing some really shady stuff and hiding money if this is in regards to some kind of um child support situation you need to take this person back and have them do <laughs> run a discovery on them because they were hiding money from you they were lying about something look i think we did see lies like they've been hiding a look not only have they been hiding their sexuality <laughs> they've been hiding money finances um something that was yours so something that is rightfully yours they've been hiding from you and I'm not getting I'm not getting that this is your anxiety. I'm getting that it's their anxiety. I feel like somebody is paying starting to pay more attention to the fine print. Somebody is being looked into behind the scenes. And whoever is sitting there looking into the situation behind the scenes, whether this is like I feel like it's clerical stuff, okay? I feel like somebody is looking into something behind the scenes and finding where somebody was hiding money. And it's in that that is also being like that is being outed in the month of August. And I see that this is causing this person who is hiding the money to have sleepless nights and be like I, I see them as like what's not seen is this person is really gonna be very dramatic and in their feelings. And I really feel like if they were trying to do anything with you involving involving the legal situation they're going to try to backtrack and offer you something in order for them not to... Which, I mean, if they're in trouble, they're in trouble. But they're going to try to backtrack. They're going to try to be smarter in the way that they deal with you, basically. Anyways, that was a shit show. <laughs> um, <laughs> y'all, what else can I leave y'all with? Because that was intense. What's going on with your actual love life? What's going on with the Scorpio's love life? Let's get out of this, this third party situation, okay? Mm, too many. What's going on with the Scorpio's love life? Their actual love life. What's going on with the Scorpio's love life? We'll take it. Forgiving and learning as you release and heal past. You experience more love in your present moments underneath it all flirt. Okay. What's going on in your love life is like the person that you're dealing with, like y'all are in the process of healing. Like y'all are going through a transformation in the relationship. You're healing old wounds. And what's not seen is it's renewing your relationship. It is allowing y'all to come into a more... Look, you're coming into a more flirtatious energy. The both of you are flirting with each other, keeping it more lighthearted. After this, like, I feel like y'all are going to come together. Y'all are healing something, old wounds from the past. Something that, I guess, one of you had thought you had gotten over, but you haven't actually gotten over. There's going to be some conversations that go on in the month of August to where, like, something is going to be healed. I really feel like it's, you know, within the household or within the relationship. Somebody is either asking for forgiveness or... 
saying they're sorry. One of you is apologizing. Somebody's apologizing in the month of um, August. And this apology is going to be really heartfelt. Like, I feel a real heartfelt apology coming through for the Scorpio. Um, and it's going to renew the energy in the relationship to where it feels it, like it. It's almost like you, you've hit restart on the relationship it's like everything's dropped everything's forgiven and like you're finally being able to move forward y'all are being able to move forward and stop staying in the stagnant energy like you're being able to move on to better times some of you may be traveling but i, I see more alone time together i see gifts gifts and i was like gifts and surprises like Somebody's going to try to recapture your heart. Like, somebody's coming in, offering love, and wanting to be really romantic. Like, I'm feeling someone's definitely going to be trying to express their love in more physical, tangible ways in the month of August. Like, y'all are moving from negative energy or, like, where you might have had, like, I feel like... Things might have been a little rough, like the waters were a little bit rough in the past, or like recent past, like <laughs> maybe a week ago, um, or a few days ago. But it's like y'all are y'all are healing the energy between the two of you. You got partnership and alliances. In regards to your relationship, y'all are learning how to work with each other. And it feels like a very strong partnership, is what I'm getting. Emotional withdrawal. Choosing wisely. Obstacles and challenge. I really feel like y'all are overcoming it. And there's going to be a lot of, um, <sighs> where the hell did that come Hot Sex on the Patio was the song that I just heard start playing. And I'm like, where the hell is that? I don't even know if that was even a real song. Hot Sex on the Patio. Have you screaming out? Ooh, daddy -o. <sighs> That's a very graphic song. Oh, God. Anyway, so, I feel like y'all are just overcoming obstacles and challenges and moving forward and learning how to work with each other. Like, it feels like a very solid partnership, but there's going to be a whole, a whole lot of um, love making going on for y'all in the month of August. Mm-hmm. Passion ignited. Truths being revealed in this relationship in order for y'all to move forward. What's not seen is, like, you're going to have to have patience with this person. One of you is a runner. One of you is a chaser. And, like, it's like y'all both got to have patience with each other in order for this partnership to thrive. But I see it, it's definitely thriving. And it feels like a twin flame partnership. It just really feels like a twin flame partnership. I'm seeing, like, sacrifices are being made on both ends. It's very balanced. Like, the scales are balanced in this partnership. Like, I believe both of you are speaking your truth and really clearing the air in the month of August. Anyways, y'all, that was a lot. That was a lot more than I was trying to give for, um the Scorpio, but y'all like, share, subscribe. If you need a personal, hit me up and check out my Etsy shop. All of my information will be in the description box below. Bye.